After over a year of strained silence between senior U.S. and Chinese military officials, the top U.S. and Chinese generals held a video conference call. Chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff General C.Q. Brown, Jr., spoke with People's Liberation Army of China Chief of the Joint Staff Department General Lu Xinli. This marked the first conversation between the two generals since Brown assumed his role. The discussion centered on the importance of managing competition responsibly, avoiding miscalculations, and maintaining open communication to reduce misunderstandings. Liu emphasized that a healthy military-to-military -military relationship requires the U.S. to understand China correctly, respecting its core interests. The leaders had not communicated for over a year, a period marked by high-profile incidents, including China's military drills around Taiwan and increased. Coercive and risky. Behavior by Chinese pilots against U.S. aircraft. The lack of communication was a significant concern, and its restoration was a priority in recent talks between President Joe Biden and China's Xi Jinping. Issues discussed included opening communication lines between U.S. Indo-Pacific Command and the People's Liberation Army Eastern and Southern Theater Commands, with emphasis on territorial and maritime concerns, especially regarding Taiwan and the South China Sea.